everyone, welcome to episode 2 of Shmup Master. Episode 1 to up. Hello everyone, welcome to episode. Ten? Episode ten of Shmup Master. That's right, episode ten. It's been four years since I started this channel, 2014, and all that time, I can only manage two and a half videos a year. Uh, that's kind of pathetic. Um, that's going to change this year, I promise. But rather than upping the ante for uh, this first video of 2018. I wanted to dial it back a bit and uh, do something simple and fun. So as you can see here, complete with crappy webcam footage, uh, I'm here to talk to you about Insector X, a 1990 Sega Genesis shmup, uh, just like how I started this whole channel, which was with Whiprush, which was also a 1990 Sega Genesis shmup. I figured what better way to kick off the new year than to start with a 1cc no death run on the hardest difficulty of a balls hard Genesis shmup, very similar to Whiprush in that regard. So, with that in mind, uh, I'm bringing a friend along for this ride. Uh, his name is Wes, uh, aka Nefarious Wes, on uh, YouTube and Twitter. He has a great channel, he's one of my major influences, and uh, one of the reasons I've kept this channel going, quite honestly. He's uh, inspired and motivated me in many ways. And just like I did all those years ago, and I used to do shout-outs on my videos, or at least a couple of them at the beginning there, I'm going to do a shout-out to Wes here, and because uh, he's come along for this ride. He challenged me to do this game on Twitter. Uh, he said he would eat his shirt if I could if I could do it because the game was so hard. So I said challenge accepted. And a month later, here you go. I did it. So, Wes, uh, take it away for a minute. Tell us a little, a little bit about you and your channel. Hey, thanks for the kind words, man. Hi, I'm Nefarious Wes, and my YouTube channel is basically stuff that I made that I would like to watch. I really like in-depth reviews, so that's exactly what I do. I love game comparisons. I'm a sucker for that type of thing. So I like to compare games like uh, Sega Genesis version versus Super Nintendo, uh, arcade versus a home console, or similar games. So I really like to do stuff like that. I'm also a huge shooter fan or a shmup fan. And I have a series called Let There Be Shooters where I cover three shooters in one episode. And I'm actually going to cover in Sector X with my good buddy Zach here. So stay tuned for that. And yes, I did say I would eat my shirt if he could no death run this game because that's how confident I was that he was not going to do it. So I have to stuff a shirt into my big fat mouth. So stay tuned for that on my Insector X section of the next episode of Let There Be Shooters. So ever since I issued this challenge to the Shmup Master, it actually inspired me to replay the game as I grew up with it uh, during middle school, and that's where I played it the most. And I really hadn't touched it for a long time. And um, I actually enjoyed it a lot more than I did back in the day, but the game is friggin' hard. It is so friggin' hard. So you're about to see what Shmup Master is in for. So. Alright, Wes, thanks for telling us a little bit about yourself there. Um, you ready to do this, man? Damn straight, I'm ready. Let's do Let's it, man. Let's do it. Here we go. Alright, here we go, man. In Sector X. <laughs> oh, yeah, the music instantly takes me back to middle school. Yeah, I like that. Uh, I like how they did that. That's kind of a cool right there for an early yeah, Genesis definitely. game. Yeah, and here obviously I just go and I turn it to hard um, and I put the player stock to one I don't because it doesn't matter, I guess. It doesn't, yeah. That's exactly. kind of my tradition with these things. I put the player stock down to the lowest it is because I'm not going to need it. So, But yeah, uh, yeah, like I said, I like that intro part. My wife got so used to hearing that she would come in the room and go, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And here we go. First stage. The stage you said you like this music the most. I disagree, but it's cool. 
Probably. We'll I don't know. We'll see. I mean, it's the most familiar. Yeah. I think, uh, there's really not much to do here, honestly. Just up and down, for me anyway, just up and down, up and yeah. down, up and down. These guys, I like to get up in their face and, you know, you'll notice yeah, that a lot. Do you get up in the face of a lot of the enemies in this game? Because... Yes. Okay, you do. That's also what I do. I tend to get up, uh, especially the parts that I start memorizing. I just get in the face of everybody, eventually. Yeah. See, now here's one thing that bugged me as a kid about this game, is that there's no parallax scrolling. Yeah, there really isn't, is there? And the arcade's the same way, but when I was a kid and I was all about graphics, that mm -hmm. really bugged me and it kind of... <sighs> It kind of made it to where I didn't think as highly of this game as others. Yeah. Which is is dumb, because I'm over that now. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't... It, it didn't... Yeah, I, it's funny thing is, I didn't really notice it until you mentioned it. You know, like, it just wasn't something that uh, that bothered me. But the, ever since you mentioned it, I was like, yeah, you know, it's just it's just a scrolling background. There's no, not mm -hmm. much else to it, you know? Do you try and line up there as close as you can get, like, at the end of the stage? Like I did no, just now, you know, no. it was a little little game that I would play. What about this part? Do you, you just go up? Do you try to kill them all? Do you no, know I stay all? to the bottom. Okay, I kill them all. I, that's always my goal is to kill every single one. I that's how I, I normally like to play shooters, not with this game. Yeah, not with this one. Yeah, you'll see. No. I get. I think I get every one there. Yeah, I do. I think I kill every guy on the first stage. Actually, that was that was always my goal was to kill every guy on the first stage. The other stages, no, forget it. But, yeah. Now, I mentioned this uh, to Wes before we started, but um, you'll notice, uh, I don't know, it's not doesn't seem too bad, but the footage jumps around a little bit, um, like it's like a jitter that we'll get on some of the stages. It was an issue with the capture card I have in this game for some reason, I'm not, not sure why, but uh, that's just the way it is, I don't know. Well, if it's done it, I haven't noticed it. Yeah. <laughs> we do this part exactly the same. Do we? That's how you <laughs> yeah. play this part, too? Yep. Yeah. That's good. I really like that secondary weapon that you have right now. But do you yeah. ever use the bombs? I use them in one spot. Uh, on really? The last, I never on the last use stage. them. I'll, okay, I'm curious to see... Yeah. I use them on one spot. That out. Yep. One spot on the last stage. Yeah, I do like the secondary weapon a lot, actually. It's uh, probably... I wouldn't say it's my favorite one, but it's, it's one of the... All right. See now, this this upgrade. Okay, we should mention when you get this third. Was this the third or the fourth upgrade? This is the third. The third upgrade. Once you get it, you see how they shoot those bullets like that. They uh, a lot of the bugs when you kill them uh, after the third upgrade, uh, they start firing bullets at you. So it makes it a lot harder. Uh, here's boss number one, and uh, you see, I just get in his face, and then I back up. I go and get in his face again, back, back up. up, and then then he's dead. Yeah. Pretty fast, yeah. Is that about how you do it too? Um, I only stay in his face as soon as he appears. Then I play it safe and stick to the back. Okay, that's how I how I did do it, and then I just I had done it so many times that I just started. You know, <laughs> I just started getting in his face no matter what. Yeah, this is the type of game where I don't want to take too many risks. <laughs> yeah, no, I, yeah, I understand. This is my favorite music in the game. I really enjoy this track. Uh, I reason. like this music a lot too. So I thought this was the standout track. Like, if you're gonna put it on one of those best of retro game remix or retro game mixes, this is the track I would pick. But that's just me. Oh, how many how many speeds do you get normally? Um, I don't keep track, but the the speed power ups don't speed you up that much by each increment. So I got once three. I notice that I'm a little too quick, then I'll stop picking okay. them up. For the longest time, I only. I only got, and here's the fifth, I think the fifth upgrade I just got. Oh, we should mention there's this two. Is the this is the fourth upgrade. The fourth, okay. We should mention that there's two types of upgrades here. You can explain to people how the weapons work, is you have your your primary gun and your secondary gun. Yeah, well, you have, you have the primary here. Yeah. Um, which can be powered up, oh, what? Five or six five times? Five times? Yeah. 
it's either five or six times. And you have the secondary gun here. This is and the, this is my. I hate this. Yeah, secondary I do too weapon. because you can't see what you're doing half the exactly. time. Exactly, it gets yeah. me killed all the time. Do you see how it kills those guys? Oh, you can kill those worms before they can come up um, with this weapon. Yeah, I didn't did not know that. I always fly to the top. Man. But you'll notice when I get around these bugs, these little flies, I stop using that because I can't see, you know? Yeah. So it's pretty much useless. See, yeah, I agree. I think it's it's almost useless except for a few little circumstances. But I like it when there's enemies behind me. Yeah. You see how all those guys are firing bullets? Like, that's... If you were to keep the first two or three upgrades and not go to the... I think it's if you keep the first two upgrades and don't upgrade to the third upgrade, then they don't fire that extra bullet. Like, this game scales... We were talking about this before we recorded, but this game scales with you, basically. Um, enemies take more hits, uh, the more power-ups you get, uh, they shoot those extra bullets. Really makes it harder when you upgrade in this game. I know, and doesn't that, like, defeat the whole purpose of I know, upgrading yeah. your weapons? Yeah, it, it, it is. Do you it, know of... It's an odd choice that they made. Do you know of any other game that does that? No, I don't. I can't think exactly. of one. Exactly. Yeah. I know there's I could, one that I exists. I not think of one either. And I'm sure someone in the comments or someone somewhere will be like, oh, this game, you know, there's this game that does it, you know, but I, well, I've I'm never sure that, I'm sure there's games out yeah. there, but I... I yeah, I've never had one... Play. Yeah, I've never had one that's quite this this extreme with, with it. <laughs> this is a good... This is... I really, I really like the secondary weapon that, that I have here. Yes. Uh -huh. That one's pretty cool. Now, this guy is a fucking pushover. Um, oh, yeah. You can just sit down in the lower left corner, yep. and he will never hit you. Yep. If you just... Yeah, you can you can get your head right where his, right where his little... That little uh, protrusion is. You can put your yeah. head right right in line with that, and, and it won't kill you. But, yeah, he's a pushover. I, I Supposedly, he jumps in the air if, if he's alive long enough. Is that... Is that true? Do you know? I don't know. I guess I always kill him before. Yeah, I thought I, I read somewhere that he did, but I never I never saw it happen. <laughs> Do you ever use the lightning bolt? Yes, I use it twice, and you'll see okay. where both both on the last stage. I don't use it anywhere else. Do you Do you use the lightning bolt? Uh, usually I don't, just because I have to switch my secondary yeah, well, weapon. Well, I'll tell you what that. That you know, you know the part, the, the very last. Well, we'll talk about it when we get there. But yeah, <laughs> sta stage three. Uh, this stage isn't too bad. Um, maybe we should explain the, the way bullets work. Like bullets, um, they track to where you where you last were. So if you hold still, um, like when you see a, a line of those bugs coming, those flies or whatever. If you hold still, they'll just they'll usually just go right over your head. Um, yeah, the best thing trick. to do. This is one of those shooters where you don't necessarily want to move all that much. Exactly. You're yeah. Safer. Yeah. The, the less you move, the better. Like on the harder difficulties, anyway. Um, uh huh. Because I yeah see see right there you see that like yeah. now if you were to move those bullets would would track you all over the place and you would probably die and they would you know? scatter yeah mm -hmm. and you see what right there I almost blew it you see I could barely graze you know that bullet almost grazed me there but. It's best to keep as still as possible in this game. Yeah, it's like you want to move at the last second. Yeah, you want to move at yeah, the very last second possible. Yeah, you're right. And I've also I'm fully powered up now. I have every all the power ups, um, which yeah. is what four four power ups for your secondary, I think, and then five or six for your main for your main gun, I think. Mm, no, so, it's five for both. It's five for both. Okay, so uh -huh. you're, you know better than I do. Which, yeah, you've been playing the game for 25 years, so. Makes more sense. <laughs> yeah, well, I didn't, I didn't play it for I'd say easily. You played it on years. and off, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because I remembered that it wasn't that great. Yeah, because right. I was hung up on the parallax scrolling. Yeah, and, right. It is a pretty basic. Then, it's a basic early Genesis game, but it but it's solid. You know, it's a solid game. I think. Yeah, when I started playing it again after, you know, you were game to do this challenge. I actually enjoyed the game more than I ever have. Yeah, yeah. I enjoyed it a lot. Um, I got, yeah, it got, I like it it got it tedious. Now. It got tedious a little bit when I was re really practicing, but um, but it was worth it, man. Once I got it, it's like I literally just jumped up and danced when I did it. You know, <laughs> when I did it that night. <laughs> yeah, I, I I don't blame you. Man. You ever try to kill that guy down there? Only if I have that secondary weapon that I hate. Yeah, right. Because <laughs> then I can yeah. drop it on him. Yeah. I, I was usually able to do it, but I, I just I didn't want to risk it this time. I was like, no. I'm doing good, I'm not going to risk it, so I just didn't bother. But I guess we're in the sewer now. There's always a sewer stage for these for every game, it seems like. 
Well, if you're in the city, yeah. Yeah, gotta be the city. Have you figured out in this game if you're supposed to be, like, really small or if you're regular size? Because the first stage has, like, Egyptian temples and shit that you go yeah, into. Yeah, but I am I take that as it's in the background. Yeah, I guess so. I I always made the assumption that you're bug-sized okay, and you're yeah, fighting I guess, other bugs. Yeah, that does make sense. It's just the scale is off on I some mean, of this stuff. I mean, on the stage two, you know, the house looks, the houses look all big. And yeah, right. Yeah, that's true. I guess so. What about this guy? You have any strategies for this guy? It's, I, guess I it's do the just, exact same thing you're doing right, right now. You just gotta dodge his bullets, and that's about it. Yep. Yeah. Try and kill him as fast as you can. I don't. I don't and try it's to taking forever way. because you have the most powerful. It's not the most powerful weapon, but you have the highest weapon. Oh, you're upgrade. right. Yeah. If you, you're and right. It took you kill him. Forever to kill him. It does. Yeah. It, yeah. That it's a good forever. point. It's a good point. Like if you have. Uh, yeah, if you have the lesser weapons, uh, you actually kill them quicker. It's really, really weird. Very it's, strange. Yeah. I've never... Yeah, like we mentioned earlier, I've never played a game that has done that. Yeah. And it's funny, I never noticed it until my friend said something, and then you mentioned it too. And then I started to notice it, but... It's funny, I never noticed it before. Yeah. Yeah, we're, now we're in the jungle, and there's, and there's a human skull for, for reference there, so I guess we are small, and those are yeah. Kids. Yeah, so... Not to mention, the, in the city, you yeah. go by that gigantic yeah. street light. Yeah, this level's a little tricky. Like, it starts, this is where the game starts getting tricky. Well, more yeah. tricky than, than usual. I had a lot of trouble on this stage. Uh, this, is, this is one of those stages where I would get to a lot and I would die. Because there's a spot coming up here a little later that's, that's really tricky. It's like, you get one of those... One of those laser shooting guys, and there's ants on the ground, and there's and there's bugs coming at you at the same time, and it's, it's those a real, guys show up real pain in the ass. Yeah, those are the only guys in the game that come from behind, I believe. I don't yeah. think there's anybody else that does. So this is a no, game where you can hang back for most of, most of the game, you know. Uh huh. If you memorize where those guys come in. Exactly. Yeah, this this part right here is, is, is tricky. Ooh, those lasers see. are just yeah. Nasty. I mean, look at look how close I came to get hit. That there. was it's close, like, man. Yeah. That part I and died at so much. those bullets are much faster, too. Yeah. Look how fast those bullets are. I know. Yeah, that's right. On hard, they go really fast. Yeah. They're... And with that weapon you have. Yep. You know, it's you funny have just when the I... basic weapon, it, those bullets kind of just hover in the air. <laughs> yeah. I think that's that's a difficulty setting, though, I think, because I, I went to play this game on easy after I... I'd never played it on easy, but after I beat it... I went to play it on easy, and the, and the bullets were really slow. Like, so slow that it screwed me up, you know? Yeah, that makes sense. Because I was used to them being fast, you know, so... But yeah, I think they, they speed up with, uh, with the yeah, difficulty increase. Yeah, these bullets pretty quick. Yeah, really quick. Yeah, this 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 part's a little tricky, too. Ooh. Yeah, That's right close. in between. You'll, yeah, you'll see me go in between a lot of these bullets, and... and yeah, it's... At this point, like... I could have done some of these stages in my sleep. I'd played them so many times, you know? It really, some of it comes down to luck, though, because it just depends on how well you're playing, if your reflexes are on, you know, and... It's still... Uh, yeah, I guess the stage... Yeah, see, that's a good trick right there. That's that's the yeah, way you want to sure. do it every time, if you can. <laughs> I just don't... Sometimes it's not possible. Yeah, and that's not possible if you have a basic weapon. If yeah. you don't have a weapon that spreads out. Yeah, you you're right. That. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the spiders are kind of a joke. They don't really do anything. And else. since I die on just about every stage... <laughs> At least once. Yeah, I'm usually in that position. What's your average uh, de use a continue or two when you beat it on, on the normal difficulty? You give uh, yourself, you give yourself it, eight I lives? Used, I used all of my continues when I beat it. And okay. I set my lives counter to eight. To eight, okay. So you use, yeah. That's, and this game is very generous with extra lives. It is very generous w with that. And it's generous, I think it's pretty generous with the with the checkpoints, too. You won't see that here, but if you die, it, it, it doesn't start you at the very beginning, usually. Yeah. Usually there's a halfway point. Okay. See how he just kind of appeared there? He didn't shimmer. Yeah, that must be a frame rate. He thing. shimmered on my end. Yeah, weird. So this guy, yeah, I, I'm just, I go up in his face and I back up, and I go up in his face and back up. And have a few little pickups there. You take it, but you take the same strategy with this guy, or you just hang um, back and uh, play it. Safe? Yes, except I don't. I I hang I hang back most of the time. Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, he's not too bad. That was actually, I think, one of the uh, one of the easier bosses for me. Believe it or not, the fir very first boss gave me a lot of trouble for a while. That spider, uh, in my opinion, is the toughest boss in the game. If you don't, because it took me, it took me a while to learn that pattern to, pattern, to know to right. okay. to get down to the bottom and move out of the way. Yeah. What about Once this I right? got that down, I was all right. What about this right here? How do you normally? I try to stay as still as possible and let yep. those bullets stay go in the right middle. Head. Okay. And yeah. let the enemies come to me. Yep, yep. That's the way to do it. Oh, that was so close, man. Jeez, I didn't realize how close that was. Yeah, no kidding. I died so many times at this part too because I'd screw. Oh yeah. Okay, now watch. Here you go. This is where I. This is the trick I was telling you about. You, you switch to your to the bomb. You let all those guys go and then you kill them all and then you go back. <laughs> And you avoid all that shit. Whoa, man. Because I kept dying at that part with all those flies, you know, because there's so many bullets. So I'm like, there's got to mm -hmm. be a way I can do this where I can... With this, you know, with the uh, the lightning bolt or whatever. Yeah. All right, this part sucks right here. This entire stage sucks. It's just yeah, it it's a nightmare. Well, it's here's the crazy thing is that... Nightmare. The... Three of the stages of this game just are made up of two halves. Mm -hmm. Stage two is just one long stage. But then this stage is like Split the length of two bunch. stages. Yeah. yeah, it has like four parts. Yeah. Yeah, there's only five stages in this game, but there's actually... I mean, you think about it, every stage is split up into, like, two stages, and they're and they're pretty good length, you know? So, I mean, honestly, mm -hmm. this game has more like ten stages total, or close to it, in reality, I think. Yeah, this part... This is the least bad of the of the three of these sections you have to go through that are like this. <laughs> but this next one uh, is, in my opinion, the worst in the game. Uh, this next part coming up here, I don't know. I think it's I think this part coming up right here is worse than the last section for me anyway. I, I disagree. I you actually really? did really okay. well at this part earlier today when I played it. Okay, this part and gave I... me the most trouble, man. Not this, but this part right here coming up here. In the next oh couple yeah, seconds. no, it's a bitch. This is a for this sure. is one of the hardest sections of any shmup I've ever played. So you'll see right here. I get in that guy's face, get in both their faces, and kill him, and then then, <laughs> then you the just gotta thing. then you just gotta avoid all the shit, man. I mean just. Look at this craziness. Look, look at this went between those two bullets. That was total I luck know, right man. there. man. It's crazy. Oh, God. Yeah, it's, hate, I get I to the point where I'm not even looking at anything but the bullets coming at me. No, and here's the part I use this. Oh, sh Okay. I use it for this, mostly for this part, um, right up here. For this right here. This is mostly oh, what I use it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This makes it a little bit easier. I thought it did anyway. I See, I never tried the bombs when uh, yeah. I had my secondary weapon powered up. I don't even know what the second power-up for this looks like. I've never even used it. Was, it. It's exactly the same as the <laughs> first. Okay. That's why I never bothered See, to yeah, check. I use it right there, too, for those frogs. Oh, that, yeah, dude, okay. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna That's start it, though. That's the only that. place I use it. It's really the only place you need to use it, I think. See, you know how I got past that part? I would just fly past them all the way to the right. Ah, okay. And, and by the time them. they would start firing bullets backwards, okay. I had enough room to dodge them. <laughs> this is the part that you hate. This You say this yes. is the worst part in the game right here. Okay. Yes. It's close, yeah, for me. Yeah, this it is this pretty This part bad. is ridiculous. Yeah. But you'll see, uh, I'm going to use my lightning bolt again. You'll see where I use it. Because it, it was a part I just could not pass without dying. And I... The lightning bolt made it possible. I don't know why I go for I go for the free lives. I don't know why. All right, right yeah, here, right I'm, here I'm gonna. I'm like that too. I right here I switch. I switch the lightning bolt right here, and then I use it right there, and I kill. Yeah, those, because those, those guys, guys from uh huh from the rear. Yeah, always That's screws it. me up. Now we're at the final boss. Damn. Quick. Man. I don't know. Do you, you make this look easy, man. Yeah, it's not. As right. you know, as anyone yeah. who would play this game. If, anyone, if anyone who's watching this, you have no idea. Well, if anyone who's watching this says this game is easy, fuck you, because it's not. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't care yeah, what you say. <laughs> yeah, this guy is a pushover, like a complete pushover. Like, the first time I ever got to this guy, I beat him on my first try. Yeah, like, me too. He's really not that hard. You just have to just dodge his stuff and look out for that stupid thing. You know there's a way to hit him at, at the top right there? When he shoots oh, yeah. that, that bolt? Yeah, I, I, I did it a few times, but I couldn't, it was, I couldn't get it to to work again. It's weird. I don't know if it was a glitch or what. But yeah, it's just it's a juggling act. You just just juggle, juggle, juggle. And it takes forever. Yeah, this boss is uh, it's kind of a disappointment that 
the boss music was the same. Like they couldn't give him his own boss theme, you know? Like <laughs> that's funny. I never like, really and, thought about and that. And boss actually. theme, yeah. It's like he's got the same damn theme as. Uh, hey, it doesn't have parallax ones. scrolling. You really think yeah. they're gonna give it's him a, his own boss? Theme? It's a four. It's a four meg uh, Genesis game, which is what 512 kilobytes or something is the size of this game. <laughs> so they didn't yeah, have much space to work with. <laughs> yeah, same size as Altered Beast. Yeah, and Sonic the Hedgehog, and of course Sonic the Hedgehog, yeah, was was four megs also. It was. And that game is uh, leaps and bounds ahead of this in terms of yeah. you know, most of it anyway. But this is yeah, this is a solid game. I you know I enjoyed it. But yeah, because you have the highest weapon upgrade, this is taking forever. I know, dude. It takes so long. <laughs> if you have just like the the. Two just the, or... the pea shooter, yeah. Just a little pea yeah. shooter, man. You can you can get up to the third the third upgrade, and yeah, there he goes. We beat it, yay! I think up to the third upgrade, yeah, where you can uh, where they're not as hard, they don't take as long. I love this this wow, English man. this English we got here. Congratulations, oh, God, all round clear bonus. So total score is one six seven six nine hundred. I have no idea if that's good or not. After many. Violent battles. The Insector Fighter finally defeated Sovereign Baglon. Whatever the fuck that means. Uh, Baglon's yeah, ambition was collapsed, and the harmony between nature and insects is recovered. <laughs> Thank you, Insector Fighter Kate. We never forget your activities. I love that, dude. We never forget your activities. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's just... That is beautiful, man. That's it. You what, know what, what I a, do like about this let down ending, ending part here, though? is how the water's like moving so like the reflection of the sun on the water yeah that is that cool that was a nice that was a nice little effect that they did yeah. but otherwise man what a, what a cheese ending man like exactly just nothing i'm yep. curious i'm curious about the instruction manual and if there's more backstory to this because i haven't seen the manual and i haven't looked for a scan i'll have to look for a scan online yeah, yeah, I'm not sure. I only have the cartridge. So. Just have the cartridge, yeah. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm curious about that to see if there's any any other sort of backstory. <laughs> well, but you know what? For a for a shooter, you don't need a story. Who cares? Yeah, it really. <laughs> it, it, you're right. It doesn't really matter. But you know. So cool. Well, thanks for uh, thanks for coming on, man, and uh, and doing this with me. I appreciate it. It was fun. Yeah, I mean, I can't believe what I just saw there. The thing yeah. is, though, is it looks easy when you do it, and I know it's not. Well, that's that's how it is with it. whenever you one CC a game. It, it the whole point of it is to make the game look easy, and in order. But the reason it looks, and you're right. After just watching that, I'm like, oh, I did, this does look a, look easier than it is. And you know, the the reason for that is because in a game like this, particularly, you gotta memorize everything. You yeah. Know? So I know where every single enemy placement is. I know exactly where to move. And so a lot of the guys I'm killing before they even get on the damn screen, pretty much. You yep. know? And that's why it, that's why it looks easy. But you know, but you know, it's not it's not easy. <laughs> it's a freaking bitch. Yeah. <laughs> it's a bitch and a half this game. So. But yeah. Yep. Cool. It was fun. This was a nice little throwback video for me. Uh, nice simple little, you know. Four year, four year anniversary of Shmup Master, man. And I've released the whole like you know twelve videos or some ridiculous <laughs> thing like that. But you know. But yeah, yeah, but how many one CCs have you done? Uh, I don't even know. I, this is what like your fourth or fifth one? No, more than that, probably. Yeah, six, you're right. It seven, is seven, yeah. eight, maybe, maybe my eighth. Yeah. Well, there's two, there's two others I haven't released yet too. So um, yeah, I'm mean, holding on to. So yeah, yeah. It, ta it takes a while, man. It takes a lot out of you to do these things. So that's yeah, definitely. Why. But you know, we'll uh, we'll see how that goes when we get our Gradius two run going. Oh, good Lord. <laughs> on that note, uh, <laughs> we're signing off. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, take it easy, everyone. Later. <laughs>